It was the movie that brings together the whole loop. You're about to watch Bunny.com and we're counting down our picks for the top 10 moments from Equestria Girls 3 Friendship Games. For this list, we're looking back at the moments from the movie that were the most entertaining and had the most important scenes to the story. But we're not including from the shorts. Sorry about that. So without further ado, let's <laughs> pony up. That was a really bad speech. You should consider not speaking in public. Number 10. Twilight and Sunset Bus Escape Technically, this is the first time we see Tsai Twai in the movie. Sunset is on her own checking up on Twilight and informing her about Canterlot High. Soon, the hooded figure we discover as Twilight investigates the magic in the statue, just before she pulled off the perfect escape. This was an awesome bit, even if it was short. It was the chosen piece of footage to premiere in the trailers, and was the first footage we get to see from this movie at all. This clarified that this movie wasn't going to be about ponies. It was a whole new thing. Number 9. Meeting Saitwai and Spike What started off as a cliffhanger from Rainbow Rocks. We see Twilight and Spike having the same partner and friend relationship as the Twilight from Equestria in the very first episode. With this device, I can track and contain the bizarre energy coming from Canterlot High. We also get to see her interaction with Cadence as they discuss her desire of wanting to work alone with close to no interaction with other students. With diagrams and papers that show Twilight investigating the school for a while now, this was an excellent way to start off the movie and propel the story. Number 8. Welcome Crystal Prep Party Started off as awkward as possible, the rival schools finally meet. Yet the Shadow Bolt seemed less excited to mingle. Soon, Pinky and Twilight get the party going and soon everybody started dancing and having fun. Sure this is a good idea? In this scene, we get to see the full design of the other ponies like Surrey Polomare, Trenderhoof, Neon Lights, and of course, the Shadow Bolts. Principal Cinch then brings the party to a halt. We see the students are open to befriend the rival schools, but Cinch influences them to behave otherwise. Number 7. Rainbow's Prep Rally with the friendship games coming up, the school isn't the least excited or motivated to put any major effort into something they assume they're gonna lose. So the mic was passed to Rainbow Dash, who had something special planned. Reminding the school of the feats they have done and the events that genuinely no school has ever witnessed. She tells everyone to embrace those experiences positively. Like the saying goes, whatever doesn't kill you makes you stronger. And this school went through a lot. Number 6. Holding a Bunny After the first events of the friendship games, the two pet smugglers had to let their friends out and stretch their legs and have a treat. After some light conversation about Crystal Prep and why they don't appreciate Twilight's work, Fluttershy does what a model person should do. Ease the pain with cute. Here, hold this. Why? Holding a bunny always makes me feel better. Well, that's ridiculous. But, oh, it actually kind of works. This was a very touching moment. Twilight had the intention to follow the scanner, but put it aside for the first time for someone else. She didn't do it for this guy, twice, but she did it for Fluttershy. Good job. I know there's more that's out there, and I just haven't found it yet. I know there's more that's out there, another me I haven't met. Number 5. What more is out there? Originally going to be a duet between Saitwai and Sunset Shimmer, 
turned out to be an aria worthy of Disney standards. Twilight walks along the halls of her school, wanting more than just what's beyond her school and her peers. We see she clearly wants something more than just knowledge, but she solves this issue with wanting more knowledge? Now questioning her real motive, Twilight is second-guessing about what she really wants, not knowing that it was going to be friendship that she'll really want in the end. Number 4. Unleash the Magic A long overdue song for Principal Cinch, but I guess now is a better time than any. A mischievous vibe gives this song a classic Disney antagonist feeling as Twilight is pressured to use the magic she's been gathering to win the final event in the Friendship Games. It starts off slow, but with the chant of the Shadow Bolt and the harsh and rather mean lyrics, this song raises to be an epic showdown. Along with the intimidating atmosphere and characters leading to the countdown, it was a great climax build. Number 3. The Triathlon Consisting of archery, roller derby, and motocross, this somehow school-approved event is overkill at its finest. Throw in some alter-dimensional plant creatures from Equestria and you've got the most action-packed scene in the movie. Despite the near life-threatening obstacles, the racers continue to race, earning Canterlot High their first win. Rainbow Dash saves Sunset, Applejack helps Twilight, and we even get to see a parody from Brave. Is this like Brave? Completely out of Brave. Number 2. The Battle of Twilight and Sunset the climax had to unleash something, right? In this case, it was Saitwai, overwhelmed with power and with the desire to reach to the other world even if it means destroying her current one. Obviously, this was irrational thinking, so Twilight is corrupted with power. But even with Sunset Shimmer trying to teach her, the one thing that snapped her out of it was Spike. Her only friend, clearly evidenced by her computer background, brought humanity back to Twilight for a second, giving Sunset the window she needed in order to finish the job. Before the number one pick, let's take a look at a few honorable mentions. I was caught in this time travel loop and honestly, it was the strangest thing that's ever happened to me. And a few dishonorable mentions. Uh, go. <laughs> nah, we're uh, just kidding. Okay. He's an honorable Bye. mention this time. Uh. Number 1. ACA DECA. The first round of the Friendship Games. Consisting of various academic subjects, the Shadow Bolts and the Wonder Colts fight with a catchy song and an awesome looking montage. Showing both schools and their strong points like Pinky and Fluttershy baking a Mona Lisa into a cake, Sugarcoat and Indigo Zap's craftsmanship, and everyone else failing at spelling. It all leads up to the star students Twilight and Sunset with Twilight scoring the win for Crystal Prep. But really, any scenario that can make something as tedious as math look epic deserves some credit. Oh, this was also the scene with Derpy in it. Are you detecting a pattern here? Well, pattern or not, do you agree with our list? Which moment was your favorite? Let us know in the comments section below, but for more top 10s posted every week, 
Be sure to subscribe and check out WatchPony.com for official voting. Thank you for watching, and you may now look away. Am I the only one who thinks this is overkill?